This is uh, Damon Barnes with ARAC Roof It Ford doing a roof inspection here in Port Ritchie, Florida. Um, on the front side of the house, you'll see some of these markings I've made. Um, what you're going to start finding is, is this right here, you'll see a line above my line. That means is that's where this uh, shingle flaps it causes wind creeps. You have more there. It's kind of hard to see. Um, I can see a lot of it from the road just because of the fact that you had you know raised looking shingles on your roof. Again, you'll see the top part here. That's all that is, is right there. It's just where it's coming up. See that? We've got more there. On the right hand side of the house. We have some more here. You can kind of see a line there above there. This here. Same thing, comes up, there, 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 there. On the back side of your house is where the most most of it is. You've got there on that uh, ridge shingle, all the way down the back side of your house. Okay, let's have a closer look at this. So this is when it starts getting really bad, is when you start seeing those really thick lines. Okay. All the way down your back. There's some behind your uh, solar fan. But you see how the darker the lines are getting now? And what that is, that means it's been doing it for a while. And you can see down here, usually you'll see like uh, some of these will have like rusty looking nails on them. But again, all through the back side of your house, you've got this stuff. And then through here, there. Right side of your house looks like all, it looks like it's all right. It seems like this is the side of the house where you don't get a lot of the wind coming in at it. On the front, you do have I think one or two. Yeah. Again, you can see the dark line here. This is actually about to come off. Same thing here. So, I do believe you guys are a good uh, candidate to make a claim, and uh, I'll be down here and to help you with that. Thanks again, Stamen.